One contestant hooked up to a heart monitor. Seven challenges, £25,000, and a thousand of your own heartbeats counting down. Yeah! Hold your nerve, breathe deeply, and keep calm. Oh. Because the quicker your heart beats, the faster your time runs out. Can you handle the pressure? This is a thousand heartbeats. Welcome to a thousand heartbeats. All that stands between our contestants and twenty-five thousand pounds are seven challenges and a thousand beats of their own heart. Let's find out if our first contestant can keep calm under pressure. Please welcome Pat. Hi, Pat. Are you doing all right? Very good, thank you. Welcome to a thousand heartbeats. And where are you from, Pat? I'm from Milton Keynes. And what do you do for a living? I work for a um, distribution company. We manage and distribute the uh, wedding lists for a high street retailer. How good is that? It's quite interesting. Very it? interesting job. In fact, a lot of pressure because if you mess that up... It's the biggest day for the bride, particularly. So, yeah, we're under pressure to make sure it's accurate and, and correct. All right, Pat. Well, throughout the, uh, throughout the show, we're going to be monitoring your heart rate. And as it stands at the moment, it's between 70 and 90 beats per minute. Well, that's pretty good. It's very good. It's very low. That will give you enough time, hopefully, to complete all of the rounds. Are you ready? I'm ready. Let's play a thousand heartbeats. All right, Pat, this is the plate. This is where all the gameplay happens. There are two rules to a thousand heartbeats. The first one, if you get a question wrong, it will cost you 25 heartbeats. OK. The second one, if you can't think of an answer that's up on the board in front of you, you can step off the plate, but it will cost you 100 heartbeats. OK. When you're off the plate, you can relax, you can chill out, get your BPMs down, but we will change the question once you step back onto the plate. Your first game today is Contrast. This is Contrast. You will see two answer options. You'll then face a series of statements, to which every answer is one of the two options. To complete the round, you need seven correct answers. Finish contrast before your heartbeats run out and you'll bank £250. Are you ready? I'm ready. Let's play. Okay. Pat, when you're ready, please step onto the plate. Roald Dahl, Enid Blyton. Play. Famously collaborated with Quentin Blake. Roald Dahl. Created the character Noddy. Enid Blyton. Was named after a famous polar explorer. Enid Blyton. Is the grandparent of author and model Sophie. Roald Dahl. Published their first children's book in 1922. Roald Dahl. Wrote the screenplay for the film Chitty Chitty Bang Bang. Roald Dahl. Turned down the Guildhall School of Music to train as a teacher. Enid Blyton. Was born to Norwegian parents. Roald Dahl. Wrote the Mallory Towers series. Enid Blyton. Well done. Come on over. Well done, Pat. How was that? Your first experience I wasn't too bad. on the plate. Not bad. You did well. Too bad. You did well. You got two wrong. You used 117 heartbeats, but let's not forget, 50 of them were for wrong answers. And you peaked at 95 beats per minute. Oh, that's not all right. I'm happy with that. brilliant. Yeah. It's fantastic, in fact. If you can keep that low heart rate throughout gameplay and keep the wrong answers down to a minimum, it will give you the perfect opportunity to try and win £25,000. So after round one, you've banked £250. If you can complete all seven rounds, then you'll get a chance to play for £25,000. Now, remember, you must leave enough heartbeats at the end of all your rounds to complete our cash-out game. Only by completing that will you leave with the money that you've already banked. Yeah. So let's move on to round two. It's reorder. This is reorder. You'll see a list of six items followed by an instruction that describes how you must reorder them. Correctly reorder all six items before your heartbeats run out and you'll bank £500. So, Pat, you've got 883 heartbeats remaining. You've played your first game on the plate, you're pretty confident. Yep. And your heart rate is really low. Are you going to play on for £500 or cash out with £250? I'm going to play on there. 
Let's play. Reorder. Pat, when you're ready, step onto the plate. Amanda Holden, Christine Bleakley, Holly Willoughby, Alex Jones, Lorraine Kelly, Rochelle Humes. Female television presenters. Age, youngest to oldest. Play. Rochelle Humes. Holly Willoughby. Alex Jones. Christine Bleakley. Alex Jones. Amanda Holden. Lorraine Kelly. Well done. Well done. I find it quite difficult with that question. You should never, ever ask a lady her age. Actually, no, I looks think so that's good. quite rude. You only use 60 heartbeats. That's good, very yeah. quick. It's really good, Pat. You peaked at 91. You've got a very low heart rate. So are you physically fit? Do you do a lot of exercise in your spare time? No. None whatsoever? No. I walk when I can, but no, I don't look to go running and I'm not in the gym, no. And, <laughs> and do you eat healthily? I try to, yeah. I do. I like a bit cooking myself, so I do like... Oh, what do you like cooking? What's your favourite dish? If I was to come round to yours for a few beers, football and some food, what would you cook? I would do chicken and chorizo jambalaya. Ooh! So, it's game ricey, on. A bit ricey, but... It's game on. I like that. In fact, we'll take the string quartet and they can accompany us as we drink and eat. It's not a bad night, is it? They can sit in the corner. <laughs> now, let's move on to round three. <laughs> it's definition. This is definition. You will see a description of a word. A series of circles show how many letters are in the word. As the letters start to appear one by one, you must work out what the definition is describing. To complete the round, you must correctly work out five words. Finish definition before your heart beats run out and you'll bank £1,000. Now, Pat, I'm not going to big you up straight off the bat, but you're doing really well. Cheers, thank you. You've got a really low heart rate, which is allowing you to play all the games in quick time. Keep it up. Yep. You've got 823 heartbeats remaining. Are you going to play on for £1,000 or cash out with 500 I've got to play on. How much money do you want to win? What have you got your eye on? I'd like to win as much as possible. But... Stop right there. That'll do. That'll do for me. <laughs> Let's play. Definition. <laughs> When you're ready, please step onto the plate. Play. The power of apparently influencing events by using mysterious or supernatural Magic. forces. A long, narrow cut or depression in a hard material. Step off. You stepped off, Pat. Madonna sang about this. It's great, yeah. <laughs> Straight away. Of course it was. So let's take away 100 from 758. You've now got 658. But this time, when we play definition, you only need to find four answers. OK. Good luck, Pat. Let's play definition. Pat, when you're ready, step onto the plate. Play. An object that is able to attract iron and steel objects. Magnet. To develop new physical characteristics because of a permanent change in the genes. Mutate. The quality of having experience, knowledge and good judgement. Wisdom. A state or outburst of strong emotion.
passion. Yes, yeah, got the Harvey. Well done, Pat. Good. good stuff, good gameplay. Nice and calm and collected. No wrong answers. But you did step off the plate. You used 217 in total. OK. So it would have been 117 had you not stepped off the plate. You peaked at 87, which is massive for you. <laughs> <laughs> but it's still ridiculously low. Are you hearing how slow the quartet are playing? I think they're struggling to keep that slow, I think. They are, <laughs> they are. I mean, they're all very well-accomplished musicians, and I think it's very rare that they play that slow. <laughs> now, Pat, are you ready to see your next game? Yes, sir. All right, let's reveal round four. It's Identify. This is Identify. You will see a list of eight answer options. You will then be shown a statement. Correctly identify the four options that are true to the statement. Each time you submit four answers, the lights at the bottom of the screen will indicate how many are correct. Finish identify before your heartbeats run out and you'll bank £2,500. All right, Pat, you've got 606 heartbeats remaining. Still really good. Are you going to play on for 2500 or are you going to cash out with 1000 I'm going to play on. Let's play. Identify. Pat, when you're ready, step onto the plate. Glasgow, Vancouver, Oslo, Shanghai, Sarajevo, Bucharest, Lillehammer, Seattle. Winter Olympic Games host cities. Play. Lillehammer. Sarajevo. Vancouver, Oslo. Yeah! Boom! Good lad. No wrong answers again. Ridiculously low heartbeat. You used 13. <laughs> Is that all? 13. That's a record. <laughs> Pat, no, it's, not bad it's a record. It's the quickest anyone has ever done a round. Excellent. You peaked 81 beats per minute. OK. Now, you've got a chance of winning big money. What's your mathematics like? It's OK. As you... a distribution manager, do you use maths on a regular basis? When I started, it was working through the orders that were coming in and working out box counts and stuff like that. So, yes, I've done quite a lot. Because we're going to play pinpoint next. OK. If you can stay calm throughout it and eradicate the wrong answers, you've got a real chance at winning some serious money. Good luck, Pat. It's round five. It's pinpoint. This is pinpoint. You'll see a grid of numbers. You'll then be given an instruction. You must scan the grid to find and work out the answer. To complete the round, you must clear three grids. Finish pinpoint before your heartbeats run out and you'll bank £5,000. Pat, you've got 593 heartbeats remaining. We're about to play for £5,000 should you choose. And it's maths. What are you thinking? I'm thinking the numbers are still high enough for me to keep going, so... So let me ask you officially, are you going to play for £5,000 or cash out with £2,500? I'm going to play on. Let's play. Pinpoint. Come on, Pat. <laughs> when you're ready, step onto the plate. First grid. Play. Add all the numbers ending in zero together. 40. Subtract the smallest orange number from the largest yellow number. 9. Multiply the two smallest numbers together. 45. Add the remaining numbers together. 36. Second grid. Subtract the largest purple number from the largest number. 36. Add all the even numbers together. 28. Multiply the orange numbers together. 95. Subtract the smallest number from the largest number. Four. Final grid. Add all the odd numbers together.
50. Multiply the largest purple number by the smallest yellow number. One hundred and ninety two. One hundred and thirty two. One hundred and twenty eight. Subtract the purple number from the largest number. 32. Add the remaining numbers together. 66. Stop the hobby! Oh, two wrong answers. Yeah, two me. wrong answers. It did cost you. It cost you 50 heartbeats. But never mind. You did it in 245 heartbeats. Pretty good. So you peaked at 99, so it's still not phasing you. It's gone up a little bit, yeah. but you're still not over 100. Woo! How are you feeling? Is this as far as you wanted to come? Um, I, I just wanted to go as far as I could and see how the game went, really. So I didn't make many decisions before. I just wanted to see how each one went and if I was doing OK, then... And are you happy with where you're at right now? Yeah, that's, that's very good. I, it uh, is very good. It's very good. Let's take a look at round six. It's Decipher. This is Decipher. You will see five statements. You will then be given a question. You must simply match the correct statement to the question. Complete Decipher by answering two questions correctly. Do this before your heartbeats run out and you'll bank £10,000. 348 heartbeats remaining, Pat. Now, do you want to play on for a massive £10,000? Or are you going to cash out with £5,000? What's the difference when you go home to the missus <laughs> tonight with £10,000 and £5,000? She's told me to enjoy it, so that's took a bit of pressure off. And that beats per minute. I think I've got enough time to play on. Good lad. Come on. <laughs> Please, bring home the reddies. Let's play. Decipher. Come on, Pat. <sighs> Pat, when you're ready, please step onto the plate. India has sent an unmanned spacecraft to it. Its surface temperature is over 200 degrees centigrade during the day. It is bigger than the dwarf planet Pluto. Its surface gravity is less than one-fifth that of the Earth. Only Americans have walked on it. Which of these statements about the moon is incorrect? Play. Only Americans have walked on it. Surface temperature is over 200 degrees C during the day. Had the middle name Aaron. Hound Dog was his first UK number one single. Was born in 1935. Married once. Stars as Chad Gates in Blue Hawaii. Which of these statements about Elvis Presley is incorrect? Married once. Hound Dog was his first UK number one single. Yes, got the hobby! Yes! Well done, Pat. Fantastic stuff. 223 heartbeats remaining. You did that in record time. 125 heartbeats you spent during that game. And you had two incorrect answers. You peaked at 91. OK. Fab. Pat, you've done exceptionally well. You've come this far. We may as well take a look at your seventh and final round. It's recall. This is Recall. You will see a sequence of 11 numbers and letters. You must memorise the sequence. To complete the game, you must recall the characters one by one. If you make a mistake, the sequence will be reset and you'll begin again. Finish Recall before your heartbeats run out and you'll bank £25,000. Pat, you've now got 223 heartbeats remaining. You've banked £10,000. The seventh and final round is the one that takes you to 25 grand. It, it does. It's a, it's a huge <laughs> jump. <laughs> Tough decision to make. 
So, are you going to play on for £25,000 or are you going to cash out for ten? i I'm going to cash out. You're going to cash out with £10,000? I'm not going to push me luck, I'm going to cash out. not going to push you luck. It's not luck. <laughs> it's not luck. It's your physical ability to keep your heart rate down. Yeah. And obviously, you know, you're very good at general knowledge. There's something up there. Exactly. So, Pat, it all comes down to this. This is cash out. You will be shown a series of statements. You must decide whether they are true or false. To win £10,000, you must give five correct answers in a row. But if you give an incorrect answer, you must start again. Now, remember, in this round, you cannot step off the plate. You've got to keep going. Yep. Are you ready? I'm ready. I'm getting edgy as well. <laughs> For £10,000, let's play cash out. Pat, if you're ready to cash out for 10 grand, please step onto the plate. True, false, play. Chocolate is made from cocoa beans. True. Silicon Valley is located in Utah. False. The first Call of Duty video game was set during the American Civil War. False. The Bangles hit single Manic Monday was written by Michael Jackson. False. Sean Connery represented Scotland in a Mr. Universe contest. True. Wow. Well, Pat, that was Bob. <laughs> Once again, no wrong answers. Yeah. No wrong Great. answers. Great. Exceptional Great. performance, Pat. Well done. Well done. You've just won £10,000. How does that uh, feel? It's, it's not sinking in. <laughs> <laughs> well done. Phenomenal performance. You've won £10,000. Now, do you fancy giving recall a go? I think we should, yeah. I think we should, because you've got 174 yeah. heartbeats remaining. See if you could have done it. Yeah. And what's away with 25 grand? <laughs> just for a bit of fun. Let's play recall. Now, Pat, you need to recall just one sequence, just to see if you could have done it. When you're ready, please step onto the plate. Y, 8, A, 6, B, W, 4, K, M, X, 2. Play. Recall. Y. Eight. A. W. Recall. Y. Eight. A. Six. W. Recall. Y. Eight. A. Six. B. W. Four. Oh! Oh! Well, you know what, Pat? You made the right decision. Point, yeah. You made the <laughs> right decision. Fantastic stuff. You cashed out. With £10,000, you were victorious and you did it. You made the right decision. Pat, congratulations. Thank you. Fantastic stuff. Thank Amazing. You <laughs> Who's next to play a thousand heartbeats? Let's welcome Neil. <laughs> uh, 
Dan Hill, welcome to A Thousand Heartbeats. It's all the way from Birmingham. Yes, yeah, sunny Birmingham. What do you do up there? I'm a brand ambassador, so basically, I'm the face of brands. So brands that you'd get in a supermarket, I promote them face to face. So um, the agencies that I work for might set up an activity in like a busy footfall area, and I'll be handing you your busy bottle of pop or your toilet roll or anything else. OK, with a bunch of leaflets that say, if you buy this, you'll get money off your next yeah, purchase, yeah. that kind of thing. We've got lots of different games coming up on the show. What would be your perfect topics, your perfect subjects for us to ask you questions about? Dare I say, assemble like that big jigsaw puzzle. That's really my lane, really. If we're talking about numbers and maths, that is another planet to me. So. OK. As you know, we're going to monitor your heart rate throughout the show, and at the moment, it currently stands around 111 beats per minute, which is not bad, it's quite high. But the more you relax, I guarantee it will go down. Are you ready to play? Yes, I am, Vernon. All right, good luck, my friend. Let's play A Thousand Heartbeats. All right, Neil, this is the plate. This is where all the gameplay takes place. Your first game today is Contrast. This is Contrast. You will see two answer options. You will then face a series of statements, to which every answer is one of the two options. To complete the round, you need seven correct answers. Finish contrast before your heartbeats run out and you'll bank £250. Are you ready? Yes, I am. All right, let's play. Good luck, Neil. When you're ready, feeling nice and relaxed, please step onto the plate. Nile, Amazon, Clay. The Jennifer Lopez film Anaconda is set in the... Amazon. ..is the name of one of the world's largest online retailers. Amazon. The Rosetta Stone was discovered in the delta of this river. Nile. A race of ancient Greek warrior women were known by the name... Amazon. The river that passes through 11 countries is the... Nile. The sequel to Romancing the Stone is called The Jewel of the... Nile. The pink river dolphin can be found in the... Amazon. Yes, Dr Harvey! Well done, here's the moment. Really good. You didn't get any wrong. And that was a nice mix of questions. Really good. Bit of geography in there, bit of showbiz. Yeah. Nice. How do you feel after that? Um, all right. You peaked at 135 beats per minute, which is quite high, but it's the first game. Now you can finally relax. You're used to the gameplay, and we can crack on and hopefully we'll win some real serious amounts of money. Let's move on to round two. It's reorder. This is reorder. You'll see a list of six items followed by an instruction that describes how you must reorder them. Correctly reorder all six items before your heartbeats run out and you'll bank £500. All right, Neil, you've got 901 heartbeats remaining. You only used 99 heartbeats in the last round. It's great. If you can keep up that pace, hopefully we'll have enough heartbeats to cash out and win 25 grand. Mm. All right? <laughs> <laughs> so, are you going to play on for £500 or are you going to cash out for 250 I'm going to play on, Vernon. All right, good luck, Neil. Let's play. Reorder. When you're ready, step onto the plate. One foot, one kilometre, one mile, one inch, one furlong, one metre. Measurements, distance, shortest to longest. Play. One inch. One foot. One furlong. One kilometer. One meter. One kilometer. One mile. Step off. 
All right, Neil, you stepped off, which means you don't want to do any more wrong answers because they're costing you 25 heartbeats. So we had one inch, one foot, one metre. Let's take a look at the right answer. The next one was... Furlong. Then that's followed by a kilometre, and then the longest is a mile. Now, you stepped off the plate, which is going to cost you 100 heartbeats, so let's take that away from 712. You've now got 612. Now, in the next question, Neil, because you've already given me three answers, you only need to give me another three to complete the question. So good luck, Neil. Let's play Riyadh. When you're ready, please step onto the plate. Monopoly, Furby, Barbie doll, Transformers, Rubik's Cube, Hot Wheels, Toys, Original release date, earliest to latest. Play. Monopoly. Hot Wheels. Barbie doll. Rubik's Cube. Hot Wheels. Yeah! Saw the Harveys! Well done, Neil. Well done. Good stuff. Distances and mathematics not the best. Toys, perfect. Well done. All right, so let's take a look at the missing answers. We had Monopoly, Barbie doll, Hot Wheels. The next one was Rubik's Cube, Transformers, Furby. Neil, during that round, you used 405 heartbeats. That's too many. Too many for one round. You peaked at 132 beats per minute. So we know where your heart rate is during gameplay. We're going to try and bring that down. We need to get all correct answers from now on in. Are you ready to see your next game? Yes, I am, Vernon. Good luck, Neil. So let's move on to round three. It's Assemble. This is Assemble. You will see a picture of a celebrity's face. The picture will be divided into eight pieces, of which five will be missing. Using the pulsing blue square, you must find the correct missing pieces from the 12 options. To complete the game, you must find all five missing pieces. Finish assemble before your heartbeats run out and you'll bank £1,000. Neil, you've got 496 heartbeats remaining, just under halfway of your heartbeat total. So, are you going to play for £1,000 or are you going to cash out with £500? I'm going to play. You're going to play. Good man. I think it's the right decision because it's Assemble, which is a giant jigsaw. Yeah. And we've all been doing jigsaws since we were children. All right, so good luck, Neil. Let's play. Assemble. When you're ready, in your own time, step onto the plate. Marilyn Manson. Play. One. Six. Step off. Step off. All right, step off. Good decision. If you can't get it, there's no point playing and wasting heartbeats. So you stepped off. It's going to cost you 100. So let's take a look at the missing answers. The first one... 12. I did say one. He said one for his chin, though. <laughs> oh, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> All right, Neil, so you stepped off the plate, which means it's going to cost you 100 heartbeats. We're going to take that away from 398, which means you've got 298 remaining to complete a full picture. All right? You've got to fill in the five missing pieces. It can be done, but you need to do it really quickly, because remember, to take away any cash, you need to cash out. All right, good luck, Neil. Let's play Assemble. When you're ready, please step onto the plate. No Gallagher.
play. Four. Two. Twelve. Nine. Seven. Eleven. Eight. Ten. Three. Eleven. Let's take a look at the last one. Number eight. Of course it was. Unlucky. You made it to round three, Neil. Unlucky. Too many wrong answers. I know. It just, it was. Uh, the questions just didn't fall right, did they? But... No. You've been a star. Cheers, pal. Thanks for having Thank me. You. Nice Thank you. Bye.